Listen to this interesting topic by Albert Einstein. Unless we can define time, is time universal? In other words, is there an audible tick-tock throughout the galaxy? A master clock, so to speak, forging ahead like Mozart's metronome. The answer, my friends, is no. Time is not absolute. Astronauts don't age the same way we do. <laughs> yep, you heard it right. And to make it simple, time itself doesn't tick the same everywhere. <laughs> Sounds like science fiction, but it's just physics. Or better say, Einstein's physics. See, if you're flying through space at near the speed of light or sitting next to something insanely massive like a black hole, time literally slows down for you compared to someone safe on Earth. This is called time dilation. Think about it like this. At just 28,000 kilometers per hour, the speed of the International Space Station, astronauts orbit Earth 16 times a day. And because they're moving so fast, they actually age slower than you do. Not by years, but by milliseconds. Now scale that up. If you could travel at 99% the speed of light, a single year for you might equal decades back home. You'd return to Earth younger, while everyone you know has grown old. It's not magic, it's the universe itself, reminding us that time isn't absolute. It stretches, it bends, it depends on where you are and how fast you're moving. So next time you look up at the night sky, remember this, out there time is playing by different rules.